Ladies and gentlemen, does evil disprove God? Some atheists say it does. While it is a very difficult and expansive issue, certainly nothing we're going to answer here completely in two minutes, I can say this. I don't think evil can disprove God. In fact, if evil exists, God exists. It's exactly the opposite. Evil disproves atheism. You say, why? Well, in order for evil to exist, good must exist. But in order for good to exist, in an objective sense, God must exist. So evil doesn't disprove God because you wouldn't even know what evil was unless good existed and you wouldn't know what good existed unless God himself existed because God is the standard of good. Evil doesn't disprove God. It may prove there's a devil out there, but it can't disprove God. Now, we can ask a lot of questions as why would a good God allow evil to continue? And that's what we do in the book, Stealing from God, Why Atheists Need God to Make Their Case. So if you want to go much deeper into that topic, you can. But the main point here is evil can't disprove God because evil requires good and good requires God. In fact, C.S. Lewis put it this way. He said, the shadows prove the sunshine. In order to have shadows, you have to have sunshine. Oh, you can have sunshine without shadows, but you can't have shadows without sunshine. You can have good without evil, but you can't have evil without good. So evil doesn't disprove God. It actually shows God exists.